she's been terminated uh, immediately upon her arrest yesterday morning, which happened right here uh, in front of the school. Tonight at 6, a South Florida school acting quickly and firing a principal accused of having inappropriate sexual contact with a student. Up until yesterday, the principal was the head of the Preparatory Academy in Coral Springs. CBS News Miami's Peter Dench tried to find out if there are other victims and joins us now with an update. Tracy Smith faces a charge of soliciting or engaging in sexual conduct by an authority figure. She's accused of inappropriately touching a 10th grade student. Police say it all started last October when the student asked the head of school, Tracy Smith, for help with his studies and started taking tests in her office at the Exceed Preparatory Academy. The student said he and the 43-year-old Smith initially spoke about family and personal issues, and then there was touching and an exchange of photos. A detective interviewed the student. In an arrest affidavit, he says, I asked if defendant Smith ever hugged him, and he said they hugged every day. She stated she never gets attention. The student stated that he felt Smith was no longer there to guide him through school and this was hurting his education. Everyone at the school was shocked and surprised by the allegations. Uh, no one had any inclination uh, that this was going on if it was. The Academy's attorney, Brian Bieber, told us Smith was arrested Monday in front of the school. We spoke with Bieber after his appearance in bond court. You think this is an isolated case? Do you think there could be any other victims? We have absolutely no information that there is anyone who's making a claim that's similar to this. A judge found probable cause and Smith was released on $25,000 bond. Smith was ordered to have no contact with the victim and not return to the school property. She's charged with a second degree felony. We asked police if they thought there were any other victims and they told us they were not sure because this case is so new. In Coral Springs, Peter Danch, CBS News, Miami.